Hi everyone, my name is Esley. Today, I want to show you how easy it is to sign contracts, rental bills, or other documents that requires your signature. You can create, sign, and send documents whether you are traveling on a weekend, in a business meeting, or simply chilling in your home. The app that I have here today is called the Sign Easy app. Sign Easy is an easy way to sign and send documents for signature. With Sign Easy, signatures are legally binding and backed by a digital audit trail. With the Sign Easy Android app, you can sign documents yourself or collect signatures in person from other signers. Let's take a minute and look at the processes for each option that we have here. To immediately start signing a document, go to the Sign Easy home page and tap the big cross symbol on the bottom right side. You can then choose to import a document either from email attachments from your Google Drive, from Box, Dropbox, or Microsoft's OneDrive. In order for us to get started, I'm going to open the Play Store app and search for the Sign Easy app. As you can see here, it's the number one search term. Just click that and we can now see the app that we need to install. I'll download and just install the app in here. After installation is done, let's open it up and we will now see the login screen here. So, let me just sign up in here for a bit. I'll go ahead and click sign up. I will conveniently use my Google account to complete the sign up process. First, let's take a look at the options for creating and managing your signature in the app. To create your signature for the first time, tap the Add Signature button at the bottom of the screen. And then select the Draw option. Select the option you want to modify when the signature page is open. You can select to use a pen style or you can select to upload an image of your signature. You can also select an ink color. Draw your signature using your finger and just tap the check mark in the upper right corner to save it. Now let's take a look at signing a document to yourself in the Android app. Open the menu on the top left hand corner, then select the signature and initials option from this menu. After that, select the signature option here. You can now start writing your signature using your fingers. And then, tap the blue pen icon on the top right-hand side to save your signature. I'll open this sample document to demonstrate how easy it is for us to reuse our signature. I will now tap the Start Signing button at the bottom. I will then select the Sign Document option. Tap the screen to begin adding your signature and other details in this form. I can click on the Signature section here and the toolbar will appear. This toolbar will take you to a page to create your signature unless you already followed the previous steps and have one saved. Just click the Signature option from the toolbar to generate the signature that we have saved earlier. Next up, I will also add text annotations to this document using my name. When it's placed, you can tap, drag, and reposition it, use the arrows to resize it, or delete it using the small toolbars that appears above it. And lastly, let's set the date. If everything checks out, we can now tap the check symbol on the upper right corner of this screen to finish signing the document. You can also easily get signatures from a second or third signer in person. Let's take a look at that process by starting with an empty document. Tap the document and select the signature option from the toolbar and you can choose for a second or third person. They will be allowed to create a signature that will be used only for this document as a security layer of the Sign Easy app. And once done, select the check mark in the upper right corner to place it, resize it, move it around as necessary, and then tap the check icon on the upper right corner to complete your document. That's all there is to it. It's also nice to remember that for security purposes, a second and third person signatures are not saved in the app beyond this document. This protects their signature from being used for a different purpose other than signing the current document. Knowing this, you will know that your mind is at ease when providing your signatures as a second and or third party user for the Sign Easy app. If you want to see future videos like this, stay informed by subscribing to my channel. And if you have any other ideas or any other videos that you want to see me create, just leave a comment below.